I'm Wrestling Days, and you're watching to my phenomenal figures, the best channel on all of YouTube. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video here today from my Fun Figures. In this video today, we have got a two in one special. We got a figure review for you guys here today. We got this new Elite 103 Angelo Dawkins, and we got these cards. Uh, I went to Smith's today. I unfortunately, didn't get time to film a toy hunt, and um, I wanted to pick up a little some. They had this Angelo. I've been waiting for it to price drop now. Um, Twenty euros actually. Twenty euros for this Angelo, not a bad pickup at all. I think twenty is a solid price to pay on a figure. I do have the Tez, so I need the Angelo. I definitely have been desperate to get the new Angelo Dawkins now. Like the old one is pretty bad. Here are the other people in the set. We got Liv Morgan, Stardust, Angelo Dawkins, Montez, Ford, Roman, and the Bobby. I do have the Bobby, the Roman, and the Tez. Only people I don't have in the set are the Stardust and the Liv Morgan. Picture of Angelo on the side of the box. And yeah, pretty nice packaging. We are getting new elite packaging pretty soon, which should be good. And here's this other side of the box as Angelo Dawkins Elite Collection. But yeah, there is the figure itself in the box. Pretty cool accessories. But yeah, and there uh, we do got the cards as well. Pretty dope. Um, I do collect these. This was like two euros, I believe. So you know, I just decided to grab it. Why not? We're gonna open the the Dawkins figure first, review that, and then actually, you know what? Let's uh. Okay, so here is the cards it's kind of hard to show the frame because it's so bloody big but here it is you know we got the card book you got the books and a few cards and uh, let's crack this open where the hell can you open this you can open this at the bottom um yeah let's open this up and let's take out the cards and see what they're like and some of them might be a little outdated like you know this might be a bit a bit older but i don't mind you know i just kind of got it it was two girls sometimes collect these so, uh, yeah, let's freaking go. Pretty nice. Take that off. Get rid of that. Um, we do got three packets of cards. Let's open these on the video. We may as well. We got three packets of cards. We got a little, like a little, like a little thing, like a little book, basically, a little thing. I think this basically shows what cards you can get. Yeah, kind of like shows like special cards and stuff like that. Pretty cool picture there of you superstars but yeah we ain't gonna bother going through this because you know that's just like that and then uh we do got the buck we got something else actually we got like a little leaflet just showing the cars pretty nice actually for two euros like it's a bargain i think and then you get your buck here and you got like a little list of every single card you can get your little thing there and there is the buckler or there's the thing you put the cards in the book uh, whatever you want to call it the collector's album Pretty cool. I'm liking that. Pretty nice cover. And the thing's already in it as well, so you don't have to put them in. Let's open these cards, and uh, let's see who we can get in these cards. Let's start with this first packet. Here we got Sasha Banks and Finn Balor on the cover. Pretty old. Like, Sasha Banks isn't even in the company. Ooh, I see Roman Reigns. We got the Tribal Chief. We got the champion, Roman Reigns. Pretty cool. Let's flip this over. Let's see what we got. We got Core Jade. Not bad. We got Trent Steven. There's Trent Seven, however you say that. We got Trish Stratus. These are pretty cool. We got who else? We got we got a uh, million dollar man Ted Debiosity, and then we got Roman Reigns. So not bad, not a bad pack. The best one, fellas, is definitely that Roman Reigns. Let's open the second one. Who we got? What we got going on here with the second pack? Hopefully we get a better pack. Oh, Humberto. Whatever reason you just called Humberto. Humberto Carrillo. Not bad. Bianca Belair. That's a pretty cool card. Uh, Drew McIntyre, whoa, that one's sick. Uh, another one of him. And then Mandy Rose. So, uh, not a bad pack there. Let's open the third pack, and then we will review the Angelo Dawkins figure. So, yeah, pretty nice cards. We got Randy Orton, the Viper. Pretty cool, doing a clothesline to Montez Ford. The cards this time are a little different than usually. Like, sometimes they wouldn't even have them doing a, mo uh, a move to someone. We got the Miz, pretty cool. Uh, we got Rhea Ripley, pretty nice. We got, don't even know who she is. And then we got Tomasa Champion. Or Tomasa, Tomasa Champion. The reason I said Tomasa Champion is because he has been championship. Tomasa Champa. So yeah, not bad in the cards. You know, two euros, not, not a bad price on that. And then we got the book. And we got the things with them. So yeah, not bad on the cards. Then we are going to review the Angelo Dawkins. Let's review this Angelo. Starting off with the interchangeable hands, we do got the open 
Mike Hens for D'Angelo Dawkins. Sick head scan. I am liking this figure. Is matching the Montez Ford, which we will compare it to in a minute. Starting off with the boots, you got the black boots. You got like the silver lining on that. That is pretty cool. We got the shorts. No details on the back. I think on the on the Tez there was like a little pocket there. On this one, there's no pocket there. You like on that part of the short. Then it says Dawkins, as you can see. And then it says a number six there, and that's pretty much it. And then on the shirt, we've got Street Profits number six. Dawkins on the back six. This is definitely fresh gear. I love these figures. I think the, the colors are amazing on these. Then we got just the wrist tape on the on the arms, white and blue. Then we got the open hands. Pretty cool. Pretty nice Angelo Dawkins. Um, it's definitely smaller than the last one we got. I love this head scan. I think it's I think it's a pretty f funny uh, head scan. I I like sometimes when they do these kind of head scans. The headband isn't really picking up. You can take this off, of course. Uh, the last leader did fall off a lot. But yeah, Humble. And then Smoke. S-Z-N. Whatever that means. Smoke. Smoke some. I don't know what that means. But yeah, headband. And then we do got the head scan. There it is without the headband on it. Pretty cool figure. I'm liking it. I would take the shirt off. But, you know, there's the torso underneath it. You know, like... It's a bit of a pain in the ass to take the shirt off. I like the scratchy shirts. It was a pain in the ass to get it off the, the Montez Ford figure. But let's compare it to the Montez Ford figure, actually. Here we have got it with the Montez Ford figure. And I got to be honest, these figures are fresh. And oh, I'm pissed about this. I scuffed the Montez Ford head scan in two places. It still looks good and all, but it's kind of annoying me on the eyebrows. I did scuff it. The shoes are pretty much the same. The pants, like the attires are very similar, like very similar attires, the, the shirt and then the shorts and then like the, the pants are pretty similar. But yeah, these are amazing Street Profits figures. I love these. I think these are, these like the Dawkins is better than the last Dawkins. We got the Tez who had like the red. I do like that figure. A lot of people, a lot of people said there was some problems with it. I liked it. We do got the Bobby as well. He did say to them, Hey, you got to pull the trigger or this group is pretty much done. You know, like Bobby did say to him, uh, we could be, this group could be done already. I don't think it is. I think that they're going to build this up and the strict profits are actually going to become heels because they're not fully heels yet. But thank you a lot for watching this video. Don't forget, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my phone figures. Hope you did enjoy the two in one uh, video today. We will be doing a Royal Rumble soon. So yeah, look out for that video. But yeah, thank you a lot for watching this video. Just wanted to get a video out. Um, Angelo, amazing figure. I think it's a solid elite. It could have came with a few more accessories, but I don't know if there's that much more you can throw in with it. I'd give it like a 9 out of 10. I think it's a solid, solid elite. I think the Tez is a solid elite. I think they're a great duo. These are all in the same set. So, yeah. Great set. I think this is a great set. Elite 100 and... Three elite 104 is pretty good as well. I got the Drew and the solo out of that. But yeah, thank you a lot for watching this video. Don't forget, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my I keep on saying it so fast to my phone figures. My phone figures out. Street Profit slash this group has been good, but they need to get a name. I'm just gonna add that. This group has been fun. I like it. New ring gear is terrible. I do not like the new ring gear they're wearing on TV. Like this ring gear is fresh. The ring gear that they're wearing on TV right now, TV right now. It sucks. That Bobby is also a very nice figure. Make this group better, but my fun figures out.